The Young Labor summer camp controversy is back in the spotlight with the police arresting a 20-year-old man and charging him with indecent assault. The party came under fire earlier this year after four teenagers complained they'd been sexually harassed at a Labor youth camp in Waihi in February. Here is our political reporter, Craig McCulloch. The emerging scandal prompted a police investigation in March and saw Labor call in a senior lawyer to review its actions. Today, news of an arrest, a 20-year-old man charged with four counts of indecent assault. Labor says it backs the police decision, but with the case now before the courts, MPs weren't keen to comment further. No, that's before the courts, so I'm not going to comment any further. Those are matters for you to discuss with the Labor Party. I don't have any particular role or comment to make on that. I'm not across it. I'm not across it. And the acting Prime Minister, Winston Peters, won't talk either. Look, the matter's sub say, and I can't make a comment. But politically, is it distracting? Have the matter's sub say, and I can't make a comment. Oh, look, we're just getting on with governing the, the country. Calvin Davis is the acting Labour leader, while Jacinda Ardern is on parental leave. He was left to field questions for the party, with its president, Nigel Harworth, turning down interview requests. It emerged late last week Labour's general secretary, Andrew Curtin, is resigning to take up a job at Air New Zealand in August. But Mr Davis says that move has nothing to do with the recent arrest, or Labour's inquiry. In my understanding, it's just one of those things. You know, he resigned last week, he's got a new opportunity, and this has come out. The review, authored by the senior lawyer, Maria Austin, was expected to report back roughly now, but Mr Davis says it will be another month. The Labour MP and Youth Minister, Pieni Henere, hopes its findings will give parents some peace of mind. Look, as a parent, you know, before we send our kids anywhere, we make sure that the environment is safe for them. So I'd expect that any event from now and into the future will take into account that you've got clearly a young group of people. And so all of the safeguards that I'd expect as a parent should be in place before a parent even sends them. In the wake of the complaints, Labour suspended all events run by its youth wing and banned alcohol from all events where those under 18 were present. The 20-year-old man is due to appear in the Auckland District Court on July the 5th. Atu iti whare parimata mō te hōtaka o te ahiahi, ko Craig McCulloch